remember where I got. Right, I'm just gonna do this. There we go. Right. So, <laughs> for people that can't play the guitar very well, um, <laughs> right. Sometimes I can play the guitar very well, and sometimes when I'm doing things all over the fretboard. It takes me a minute to remember what I just did, so don't judge me. But yeah, I swear I'm a platinum producer. I swear. this top line in my head like all day yesterday Maybe I'll add a little more reverb. <laughs> You're right, actually. Just a little bit. Uh, just a stereo shaper, the one that um, Seth got the way he uses this, and so does Cook Up. I actually saw it on Cook Up stream. Um, before I try it out, and it makes everything sound so fire. I use it on my electric guitar as well. Uh, reverb, delay, and then a simple EQ. That's all you need.
It's so important when you make a guitar uh, guitar loop to try your hardest to make everything on time before you quantize it. Like try and play on time as much as you can. You can save everything with quantizing it the right way, but it's the quality is not going to be as good if you're really out of time. So keep recording it until you are in time, no matter how long it takes. This is my guitar that I'm using right now. PRSSC. Right, I'm going to add a lead line to this. I hate doing lead lines on this guitar because the strings are so rusty. <laughs> Crackling, bro. Have this reversing. Okay. So much reverb. Watch, everything's gonna have so much reverb on it.
Everything out. Oh. 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 